G'day everyone, Jason Haynes here once again, QPL Rural with another edition of the Soaker, your weekly look at water markets across the Riverina. So some all good rain last week, certainly very good to see and a great start to that dry land season. A little bit early, but absolutely fantastic. A good charge up in the catchments there and we have seen Murrumbidgee prices as a result drop down. We're now trading at numbers around $40 a megalitre if you're pumping out of the river. So very good prices there. Very easy to make things work at those levels. If you're on the Murray system, zone 10, zone 11, you're looking at numbers now that are just under that $100 a megalitre. If you're in the Goulburn space, you're around that same number. And if you're up on the Lachlan, we're quoting numbers around that $130 a megalitre at present. Now, there is speculation we're going to see some very big autumn plantings this year with commodity prices still good and the available water. So expect to see a little spike in demand there as people jump into that autumn season and water up those winter crops. No doubt there could be more water put out onto winter plantings than what we've seen in a number of years. So not a great deal of movement on groundwater this week. Lower Murrumbidgee Zone 3 groundwater still quoted around that $80 a megalitre. Very hard to find, not many people moving on that groundwater at the moment. I've seen some zone two at 110, so uh, again, large passes, a bit difficult to find on zone two. If you lower Murray groundwater, not a great deal of movement there, around that $50 per megalitre, and if you're up on the Lachlan, where you're paying up at around that $80 to $90 a megalitre. So the supplementary event that did pass through the area in the last few days, uh, it's still operating down the lower Murrumbidgee. We have seen supplementary water traded in small amounts around that $25 a megalitre too. So some opportunity there for supplementary water holders to move a little bit around and to top up some storages. Storages this week, well, the general rain has been very good for storages. We've seen Blowering Dam currently sitting at 75.7%, which is a lift of 0.5 or half percent. The Burrenjuk Dam currently sitting at 71.7%. It's lifted 2.1% in the last week. Hume Dam, it's come up one full percent to 55.9%. Now, there is speculation with this week's water announcements too that Hume or that Murray system may see an increase in allocations up to 50%. So it'll be just interesting to see how that goes. And last but not least, Dartmouth Dam, well, it's lifted 0.68% to be currently sitting on 63% of capacity. Now, our buyers this week, we are looking for some forwards. We're looking to secure water for next season at the moment. So if you've got people in the Murrumbidgee system that are looking to sell forwards, please let me know. Also, we've got active buyers looking for Zone 2 and Zone 3 bore water still and some entitlement lease opportunities if they are available for Murrumbidgee water. Now, as always, if you'd like any more information here on anything we've talked about, please feel free to give me a call, 0488 594 450. We'll catch up again next week. Cheers.